All right. So, Andreas Hotvite, no pressure whatsoever. 94.75, the score to beat. Remember, he took the win at the first stop in Breckenridge. Right now, he is in fourth place. Switch right side, 450 on, 270 out. Absolute stallion when it comes to spinning both clockwise and counterclockwise with that validity. Switch 12, 63 and a half. Such a strong legged competitor. There's the forward double cork 1080 looking solid down at the bottom. When we see the Misty Four off, yes. So get out your currency converter. Let's talk about the rotations. 1260 compared to Wallace's run. Is that going to challenge at 94.75? Let's break it down a little further. Up top, Wallace might have been a little bit cleaner on that rail, slid the whole thing. Down in this section, I would say Andreas right where he wants to be, maybe a bit better than Wallace. Here's a trick that they both had in their run. Switch right side 1080, certainly very comparable. Wallace's, I would say, had a little bit different execution, a little more creativity perhaps. Here's the double. Both athletes had a big double flip. Both executed very well. Down into the bottom section. Andreas on the second jump had the switch 1260, which would probably directly compare to Tom Wallace's forward 900. Switch 1260, much more difficult. Have a look at that. The 450 inverted off the rail. So quick, um, before the scores come in. Who would you give it to? I think that um, I think it's still maybe in Wallace's hands. Yeah, over there, hot fight in 93.63 jumps up to second. That means Tom Wallace takes the win here at Snow Basin. First in Breckenridge was epic. I was super stoked. I got lucky, and I, it was a good course for me. This one, I was a bit more skeptical. Didn't really like the course at first, but that last run, I just tried some tricks I haven't even done in practice, and I landed it. So I'm just so stoked for a second. Yeah, yeah, just to be able to land a run and get on that podium, undescribable. I'm probably the happiest second place guy ever.